Hi folks, I'm Ian Baker, the product specialist here at American RV in beautiful Grand Rapids, Michigan. Today I'm going to talk to you about the 2017 Keystone Passport Elite 23RB. This is a beautiful, lightweight rear bathroom floor plan. Let's go ahead and start on some of the features outside. We'll head back and then uh, we'll take a look on the inside. So right up front here is power tongue jack. This of course is going to make it nice and easy to connect and disconnect from the tow vehicle. Rather than having to crank it up and down, you just touch a button and and the work is done for you. Also right underneath is going to be a light, so if you are looking to disconnect or hook up at, or, uh, at night, that's going to make it a little easier. Right behind is the uh, propane tank cover. You have two 20-pound propane tanks in there. Behind that is the tray for the battery. And then this is beautiful. They have a fiberglass front cap on here. You can take a look, see the rock guard that they have on the bottom half, which looks very nice and is going to help protect the front end, make sure it doesn't get any rock chips or from anything that gets thrown up by the tow vehicle. Let's take a step around to the side here. I'll open up the pass-through. You can see in there, very large pass-through. This does have aluminum um, for all the framing, which is great. A light in there as well, so if you are accessing it at night, it is nice and easy to do so. But big doors on the Passport, both on the door side and the off-door side. That way, if you have wider items like a grill or a large chair, you can go ahead and fit it in there. Let's take a look up top at the roof line. You'll see the nice rolled roof edge. Because they have the front cap on there, it allows them to bring that roof edge down a little bit further, which is again gonna give you greater protection against any kind of water penetration. Also, rain gutter will take the rain to the front and back, so it's not gonna drop down on your campsite. Speaking of rain on the campsite, you can see you have a large power awning here as well. Touch of a button, that rolls out, same to go back in. And there'll be an LED light strip underneath, so you don't have to hang your Christmas lights lights. Two outside speakers, so if you want to listen to music outside, you can easily do that. Those will be controlled by your multimedia center inside, but they are going to be Bluetooth capable. So if you can, you can use your uh, smartphone or tablet to go ahead and connect to that. Frameless windows on the Elite. That's going to be a really big advantage too. Not only do they look a lot nicer, but also the seals are going to be protected because they're behind the tinted glass, so they're not going to get exposed to the elements, meaning your windows are going to last longer. Also, because the way the frameless window opens, it tilts open kind of like this, that means you can open these up and leave them open while it's raining, and you can still get nice airflow coming through. Let's take a step back here. We'll take a look at the uh, the rims. Aluminum rims on here. The big advantage of aluminum rims is just not going to rust or corrode easy, uh, as easy. And take a look. I mean, they're absolutely gorgeous. Adds a lot of pop and flair to the unit. Also, this does have load equalization axles, which is a uh, spread axle system, meaning that it's uh, going to have a lot better towability. It's going to help reduce sway while towing. Three steps to get into the coach make it nice and easy, and it's going to be uh, assisted by the easy grab handle right here. So from the first step all the way into the last one, you'll have a handle to help you in. This unit is good for extended season camping. What that means is underneath you have a fully enclosed and heated underbelly, so none of your lines are going to freeze up on you in the cold weather. That's extremely important, especially if you like to camp late into the fall season. You know you can do so safely. If we come around to the back of the unit, right here is going to be an arm for a grill. The grill does come with it. That will be inside, uh, but you can go ahead and mount the grill there and just swing it right around, and you'll have a propane quick connect right here underneath, so you can just pop it right in there and it'll feed off your big propane bottles. Take a look up top. You can see that it'll have a uh, crowned roof. That's good too, because that way water's not going to sit on top of the roof. It's naturally going to run to the sides for you. Spare tire right here. You know, that's important. Hopefully you never have to use it, but in the event that you do, it's always a great thing to have. Let's come around to the off-door side real quick. A uh, couple last things of note. One, this unit does have a black tank flush. If you're not familiar with that, what that does, instead of having to take a hose and put it down your toilet to wash out your black tank when you're done camping, with the black tank flush, all you have to do is take the hose, put it right here. That black tank will have sprayers built into it and it'll wash it out for you. Also right above that is the outside shower. This does have both hot and cold access. All right, I know you're excited about the outside, but let's go take a look at the gorgeous inside. Welcome to the gorgeous inside of the 2017 Keystone Passport Elite 23RB. Let's go 
go ahead and start off right in the back. As soon as you come in the door, take a look at this. Huge wardrobe space. This is going to go all the way across. The thing I really like about this is if you want, you can use it for clothes. You know, maybe you can use one side to hang up your jackets so when you come in, you have a place to put your coats. Nice cubby hole down here for shoes. Really whatever you want. I just love the uh, availability of the storage there. Then right here, full extension ball bearing drawer. And underneath, take a look at that. Again, great storage. You have a shelf built in. If you want, you can put a small trash can in the bottom. Uh, just, you know, great built-ins. I love what they did here. Thermostat's going to be tucked away right in the back, and your main control panel will be up here. Nice thing about that, again, is if you have kids or grandkids that come in, they're not going to be messing with the controls, moving the slide in and out. Right in the back, as I mentioned, this is a rear bathroom, so again, nice decorative door, kind of spices it up a little bit. But come on in, I can show you right there, it's going to be the toilet, plenty of leg room all the way around. The shower here is a neo angle, I'll open that up for you. You can see in there, nice glass shower enclosure, skylight up top, great shelving, hand wand in there as well. Then over to the side, it's going to be your sink top and vanity, storage underneath, plenty of room, plug in. Then up above that is the mirrored medicine cabinet with additional storage. Then the refrigerator will be right over here, the medic fridge and freezer combo. Six cubic foot, but it's plenty of room for two people. That's all you need to bring with you. You have a cutout right there for taller items, couple of drawers in the bottom here. Then let's shoot across over the other side. So I love the kitchen, the 23RB. You have the solid surface countertops here, absolutely gorgeous. A ton of prep space. Take a look at how big the countertops are. Smaller coach, but a ton of room, which I love. Have a little bar over here. We'll talk about that in just a second. Uh, up top here, you have the raised panel cabinetry all the way across the top. Nice brush nickel pulls. Open that up for you. You can take a look. Good storage there. Um, you know, a microwave right here here. Underneath, take a look at that. Excellent storage down there too. Perfect place for pots and pans. You have a ton of room there. And then same thing, take a look. You want more pots and pans? Huge deep drawer right there underneath the oven. Um, you can open that up, of course, that's what, anything you want to bake. But this is Atwood three burner cooktop, uh, high output front burner on there. Up above that's your fully functional hood with a light and a fan. As I mentioned, more storage up top. Look at that beautiful pantry space. That's going to go all the way across right there too. Big window, so during the day lets in a lot of natural light. Then underneath you have LEDs, so that way it's going to be a nice bright kitchen whether it is nighttime or daytime. Sink top covers, again, are going to be solid surface, so it blends right in. Single bowl stainless steel sink. It's a nice big bowl, though. It's a very deep bowl. Uh, a lot of times, you know, the stainless steel sinks, they give you these bowls, and they're not very deep. They're not going to be very usable. Not the case here with the 23RB. Uh, that sink is perfect. Also, you have the nice high-rise faucet here, too. This does uh, have a pullout on there, so that way it is nice and easy to wash dishes. Underneath the sink, we can take a look. Great storage there too. Perfect for all of your cleaning supplies. And then over to this side, you have a bank of four full extension drawers. So you can take a look there, you know, plenty of space for silverware, you know, all your big uh, like spoons and spatulas, things like that, hot pads, whatever else you need, you have the room to do it. So something else that's really cool, I like to give you bar stools, because this right here is going to be a bar area. So you know you can have someone setting here on the end, you can have someone on this side. You don't need a table, this is perfect. It's only going to be the two of you most of the time. So you can sit here and enjoy a meal together, whether it's breakfast, dinner, a cup of coffee, whatever you want. But I just love this setup and the solid surface countertops are just gorgeous in here as well. Uh, on the off door side, this is going to be your slide out. Uh, so right here is a tri-fold sofa. Cool thing about the tri-fold sofa one it's extremely comfortable so you have a perfect uh, spot to sit here and watch TV which I'll show you in just a moment you know if you want you can uh, you know put some stools in here something kick your feet up but also if you do have any guests they want to stay the night this trifold this makes a very comfortable bed that two adults can sleep on and the cool thing about a trifold is every part of it is going to be a cushion so you don't have a big bar in your back like your traditional pullouts and you're not gonna have to worry about an air mattress deflating on you in the middle of the night so if you do have guests again very comfortable bed right there or hey maybe one of you snores and you want to kick them out of the bed right you can do that too but uh, right over here excellent window space again letting in a lot of natural light 
So let's shoot back across the other way here. This is going to be the TV, uh, 32 inch TV. This is on a swing arm mount. So if you want to watch while you're cooking, you can do that. You know, same thing if you want a perfect angle while you're sitting on the couch, or if you want to turn it over to when you're in bed, you can do that too. Also right underneath, you have additional hooks. So whether you want to use that for, you know, robes, jackets, whatever you want. Uh, I like that they put that there. And like I said, I kind of like the idea of a robe hook so you can get up, put it on if you need to go to the bathroom in the middle of the night uh, or something to that effect. Right down here as well, kind of a second access point for storage underneath the countertop. Huge storage there, which is awesome. And then up front, this is going to be a 60 by 80 queen residential bed. So nice big bed right here. Uh, this does lift up. You do have storage underneath. Then as I mentioned, right over there is your grill. So if you did want to do some outside grilling, you can certainly do that too. Uh, right up here on the side of the TV, this is the multimedia center. So I uh, briefly touched on this when we were outside. This is going to be a radio, CD, and a DVD player. Uh, this will control the speakers inside as well as outside. But the cool thing, I love the fact that DVD players, you can just pop a DVD right in there and it will pop up on the TV. If you do want to bring uh, different auxiliary components, like you know, if you're a little more technologically advanced, you have a Chromecast, something like that, this TV does have HDMI input, so you can bring that with you too. Uh, windows on both sides of the bed allow for a great cross breeze and let in additional light. Up above the bed, not only do you have the nice uh, elite engraving there, which looks really cool, but also uh, you get the tinted glass and you get uh, some additional storage right up there, great shelving space, so any kind of folded clothes you can put right up there. And on both sides you have mirrored wardrobe, and again, additional hanging space. So you have space in the back, you have the hooks here, you have uh, this on both sides. And if you look right underneath that wardrobe, you'll see shelving. That side's gonna be a little bit bigger, but both sides do have electrical outlets. So whether you need to charge a cell phone, uh, a tablet, or if you have a CPAP machine, you can put it on that side of the bed, and that way you can sleep comfortably while camping. All right, folks, that's pretty much gonna wrap it up. Uh, again, this is the 2017 Keystone Passport Elite 23RB. This one is in the rattan interior. It's a fantastic couples coach. I love this coach. It's nice and lightweight, has everything you need. Beautiful, solid surface countertops. You're gonna have ducted heat and AC. You have a slide out with the couch, and that that's gonna be a tri-fold sofa, which is an awesome sleeper. You have the bar stools. You really need to come and take a look at this coach. It's gorgeous. If you do have any questions or comments, uh, please leave those in the section below or you can always give myself Ian Baker a call here at American RV and I'll be happy to answer that way as well. If you have particular questions uh, about specs on the unit or if you want to see current inventory I highly recommend you check out our website which is AmericanRV.com and you'll find all the answers you're looking for. Thanks again for watching I'm Ian Baker and I can't wait to see you on the road to freedom.